Leslie. Today I'm going to be doing something a little different from what I would normally do. Today I am going to be doing a what's in my makeup bag, of course, but I'm going to be getting ready for my makeup bag and it's just like basically whatever I have in here I am going to get ready with. So this is how my makeup bag looks. It's extremely packed. It's like jam type pack and it's normally really jam packed like this because I've been telling myself that I'm going to carry less makeup and I'm going to use a smaller bag to do that but in all honesty what I've been really doing is taking the same amount of makeup that I carry in my bigger bag I just kind of pack it in this little bag if I can. I'm going to show you guys what I have in here first. So the first thing I see popping on top is this little One Wish little lipstick from Kylie Jenner and then I have this Nutcracker sweet copper face palette from Miss Ruff Guild. I have a couple of these I did. Um, I thought Miss Ruff Guild was never coming back, so I invested. I have I have a lot of big stuff on top and like little stuff to the bottom. And then I have this Burgundy Time Sign palette. I don't, I never ever really use this unless I am in the car and getting ready and I barely ever use this then. I have my Colourpop No Filter Concealer and I decided to throw this in my makeup bag just because I know that I would not get any use out of it if I kept it in my makeup drawer just because I'm not going to reach for it. It's not something that I would reach for so that's why I have that there. I have my One Step Makeup Forever Primer Equalizer little thingy. I'm almost done you guys I just have a couple more items I have this little I have this compact here from Clinique and end up with the concealer stick why would I have that it's so dark um, I always have one of these in my bag I ordered like six of these and then I have oh I was looking for this this is my chubby stick in the nude and uh, this is just a foundation from Clinique I'm glad that I found that I have a few more items in here. I have a lip gloss here with a lash on it in Sweet Persuasion and from MAC. It's glitter glue. I don't know why. I don't, I would never understand why, but I have glitter glue in my bag. And lash glue, which is important. I do use that a lot. I have an essential oil, which I don't need. I have two more products in here. I have, ooh. Cool Brown and Latte lipstick from Anastasia Beverly Hill, both with no cover. And I do have, I know where one of the covers are, but I don't know where the other one is. And then I have, ooh, some coins in here, and I don't need those to get ready. And that's it. That's all that I have in this little stuffed bag right there. The only thing I'm going to be doing um, is using brushes that because I normally would have like a little I have like a little um, brush belt in my purse like very very little with like brushes like these size so maybe I can just try to use like brushes and stuff that's like this size if I can find a few in my collection I do realize that I only have literally one lash in my bag and I think this one is intoxicating from um, flutter and to be honest you guys this lash is too big it's either no lashes or just get another um, another lash and I think I'm just gonna get another one because um, just because I don't want to be walking around with one lash I'm gonna look like a crazy person so it's either no lash at all or you know throw on another lash I'm gonna be real with you guys you know I'm not gonna just stand here and be like oh one lash all day lies so um let's get real i do primer and you know what it's just really to show you guys what i have in my makeup bag this is not like a look because i'm not sure how this is going to turn out so half of the products that I would use like literally on my face like I don't even have setting powder or anything like that um inside my purse so half of the things that I would have in here I don't so I don't even know where this look is gonna go so most of this is going to be fast forward like just just to kind of show you guys 
the products and whatnot. I am going to take this a chubby stick here. I'm going to conceal these dark circles under my eyes. I know I look tired, but I promise you I do get a lot of rest. I don't even know what I am going to set my face with. This is crazy. <laughs> Why did I agree to this? I'm just gonna use my powder here and maybe, you know what, yeah, I'm gonna use this little sponge that it comes with in here. Gotta be a little, gotta be creative nowadays. I'm gonna take that and that is not cute. Oh my god, it looks so orange. <sighs> this is the products that I normally have in my car. It's just that half of the products that I have, I just do not use. Like, I just won't use. I forgot to use this stick because this is the only thing I have to contour with so let's try using this to take this ColourPop concealer and prime my eyes because I don't have my NC45 which is what I always use to prime my eyes. I'm gonna take this itty bitty 217 brush here with this trusted palette from MAC and the Burgundy palette. I'm gonna take, what name is this? Ho. Ho, H-A-U-X, Ho, whatever. And I am going to apply that in my crease. I am um, taking a little bit of sketch now and bringing it down because like I mentioned earlier, this color is so dark underneath my, so orangey underneath my eyes. Like I have to do something to like avoid it looking so orangey underneath there. I'm gonna take my highlight here and put that in the inner corner of my eyes. I'm also going to take that same highlight and apply it on the high points of my brows. Sketch in my crease. pumpkins so while I was doing this look I realized one thing I do not have mascara and I do not like to put on lashes without mascara but I have to put on these lashes now because I don't even have mascara all right so while that glue is getting tacky I am going to try to do something else with my face I am gonna put on this blush in here because I don't have bronzer so I'm gonna use the blush in here and start from the outer, I guess, and work my way in. <sighs> I'm gonna take this 
um, highlighting brush here. Here we go. I don't even have a setting. Like, I don't even have a setting spray in here. And I have a little Smashbox one. I don't know why I don't carry that. But I'm going to take um, Hawk Wind. You know what? I'm going to find a lip color first. I have Cool Brown, which is like my favorite lipstick of all time. And Latte. I'm going to do Latte. Yeah. Let's do Latte instead of Cool Brown today. looks really good with latte. I've never used these together before. Yeah. Wow. I think I just found my lip combo, you guys. I have a lip gloss here in Sweet Persuasion. I'm trying to forget if I should put this on. Put a little bit because it doesn't hurt to put on like a little gloss, right? Just a little bit, right? Okay guys, so I just got ready in my makeup bag. I am truly surprised because this video here made me realize how much crap I have in my bag that I just don't need. Like all these extra lipsticks and like, oh my goodness, like I have things in here that I just, I like uh, oils and like, I need to put things like what I really need just in case something like this really do happen. Like glitter glue, why? Come on, like I really need to uh, make sense of my makeup bag. I'm glad I did this video. I do hope that you guys enjoy it. If you want to see more videos like these, don't forget to like and subscribe. I will have all that information in the description box down below. And also at the end of the video, I will have a picture of my face with me looking down like this. You can click on that and you can subscribe to me. Also, I will have my previous videos on the left and right of me. You can click on any of those if you want to see what I did prior. And don't forget to hit the notification bell on your way out. It just lets you guys know when I will have new videos up. I will see you guys in the next one. I hope that you're having a great day. Bye pumpkins.